The shells of burned out cars litter the Sunland Tahunga area. This one off Little Tahunga Canyon, another one off Valmont Street, and then there's the charred trees and burn spots of McGroarty, where these cars were burned over a week's time. One witness didn't want his name on camera. I, I, woke, I woke up and I was, I was, it was completely engulfed. I ran to the neighbor's house over there and knocked over there to uh, tell them to call the fire department. They were trying to say, well, it's kind of suspicious, but maybe it was the ignition. I said, the car actually has been sitting for a week, so there's nothing hot inside the car. That was her family's Camaro on May 1st. Then on the 16th, her son's Accord's front ended up burned when another neighbor's vehicle exploded into flames in the middle of the night. The car was completely engulfed. Uh, and when the fire department, they came out and put that out, and then a half an hour after that, there was another car that caught on fire right around the corner. They put that one out, they responded and put that one out. I went down the next day to investigate and ask them, you know, what they were doing, and they said it was just, uh, there's nothing they could do, it was just maybe a faulty ignition, which made no sense. On several cars on the same block? Right. It appears as if the cars in Sunland to Hunger are spontaneously combusting because we're not getting any feedback on what's causing them. It's just you come out and there's a fire and the fire department puts them out and then that's the end of it. And it keeps happening over and over and over. The San Lantahunga Neighborhood Council reaching out to us. We've reached out to fire officials, LA City. They say they know they're happening. They're not calling the arson at this point. The concern of the residents is that it's a matter of time. You see where it's spread here to the fence, that it may end up at a house, or even worse, the hills all around here. This is the Verdugos, and they've had quite a few brush fires that have come awfully close to home, so they want this to be looked at a little bit more seriously, perhaps.